Hello and welcome back to No Man's Sky, everybody. Elon Paul here with the Weekend Anomaly mission and some news, of course. Now, I know there's a lot of people that are playing the expedition right now, and this is kind of going to fall by a little bit by the wayside. But, you know, we do have to do these anomaly missions. I Personally, this particular save, I kind of need those that quicksilver. i got to build it up. So we're going to keep going with it. So let's get started and we'll talk a little bit about things that are upcoming. Uh, for instance, tomorrow we will be doing, that is Saturday, the 29th, at around 4.15 or so p.m. We are going to be doing a speed run. Welcome you all to join us at that time. Uh, so let's see our, our anomaly mission, communal habitation. We've got to construct an outpost. This ought to be interesting because this is my tertiary or my latest new save that I've got. So it's going to be very, very interesting to see how this goes. We've got 1800 Quicksilver and a factory override unit, which we have all found is pretty much useless at this point, but we'll see how it goes. Uh, and I could always use the reward of the credits, of course. Uh, so I'm going to initialize the mission and start it. Real quick, I'm going to check my inventory, make sure I've got some room in here. I have nothing. I've got a little bit of room. I've got all these bones I really need to sell. So we'll maybe get that going too. All right, so again, tomorrow night, Saturday, 4.15 p.m. Eastern Time, we'll be doing speed runs of the expedition. I have a secret. I have been studying it, and I've been working on it. So I think you're going to be pleasantly surprised at how fast we can get it done. So that will be a thing. Uh, what other news? Um, so, yeah, the expedition's going strong if you haven't done it yet. I think uh, I've got a video coming out next week that I used on this save to show you how to do it from one of your main saves that you can get it done in well under three hours, even with reading everything and studying everything. But I'm showing you a quicker way to get things done. So there you go. Check it out next week as well. All right, so we're at the system. I'm not even going to bother trying to pronounce it. Um, please tell me it's not the planet in front of us. Let's find out, because it's a... Ooh, good. All right, that was Aggressive Sentinel Planet. Fractured Planet Potential Construction Site. Copper, gold, and sodium. Okay, well, that's interesting. Let's go ahead and line up. And, of course, we can't, because a ship just popped in our trajectory. Unbelievable. Really? Really? You had to park right there, didn't you? Unbelievable. All right. There we go. Now we can lock in and go. Fractured planet. Interesting. We have to produce a construction site, like a habitable base, per se, on our planet. That's going to be interesting. Uh, let me use one of the radiant shards. That'll work. Okay. Wow. Take me all the way to the other side. Love it. All right, so in this particular scenario, it really doesn't make a difference which side you land on or where you land. You just land. Um, that would be difficult to build down there. So I think what I'm going to do is go up on one of these little plateaus here, and I'm going to build up here instead. There's nothing up here. It gives us a nice flat surface to work with. Yeah, look at that. Nothing here. This would be awesome. Interesting. So it's not low atmo, but very, very, very different. All right, so established question. Okay, we got to do the base computer, so let's do that first. Uh, there we go, chromatic metal, 30. Your cells much? Your cells. Your cells much? Colony. Uh, no prior construction. We're going to claim the base. Let's get that going. Uh, let's see, we've got some deposits around us. I don't see anything that resembles a building or anything like that, but we don't really need to worry about that here. And here we go. So, first thing, we want a biodome. I think we need glass for that. I'm pretty sure we don't have any on board. Uh, let's see. Hold on. Let's check. We're going to need five glass for that. So, let's go ahead and get our... Do I not have a refiner on me? How fascinating. Uh, let's see. We should have one in our inventory. Excellent. Yeah, this particular save, I haven't gotten to that point yet, so. And we're going to use silicate powder if I can find it. Do, 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 do. I still have the fiber in there from last time. Good grief. Really need to go through my inventory and sell some stuff. How embarrassing. Uh, silicate powder. Got plenty. Let's put that much in, but we're going to tell it we just need five for now. I don't know how much more it's going to want us to do. 
Interesting. So yeah, silicate powder gives you that. It, it tells you frost crystals, but honestly, it, you can get silicate anywhere. So use the silicate. It's so much easier. But yeah, it'd be great if I had an onboard unit, huh? I hope I don't have to combine metals or anything like that, or minerals, I should say, to, com to make stuff, because that's going to be a pain in the neck. There we go. Got our five glass. Let's construct our biodome. So I guess we'll put that... Eh, this is fine. Really doesn't make a difference, does it? Alright. We need a door. Uh, what's this door? So we can do that. We'll put it... it it's going to really... It's going to be on the other side of the whole dome. Okay. We'll just put it right here. That's fine. Uh, curved corridors. So we'll need some of those. It's going to require 75 pure ferrite. We should have plenty of that. Why couldn't it put the door there? I don't get it. We'll put it over here. And we'll put another one over here. Okay. Uh, it wants another biodome. Unbelievable. So why don't we do this? Let's take you, and I'm going to put it like that. There we go. Okay. Five more. Yeah, a lot of this is construct and wait, construct and wait. Now, if I had my other main save, it has tons and tons of glass already in the inventory. I could just pull in my freighter and get it, so. But, here's what it is. Okay, four. Come on, there we go, and one more. There's our five. Okay, biodome. Put you right there. Okay, what's next? Uh, what? Okay, there we go. Power supply. Biofuel reactor wants six of them. Good golly. Alright, let's just put them out here. Uh, what do we need? Metal plates and oxygen. We should have plenty of oxygen. I'm not sure about the metal plates, but I guess we'll find out. I'm going to line them all up here. So one. Two. Oh, we need metal, more metal plates. Let's get more. I think we need one more. There we go. Three, four, this is not a pretty base, five, and six. And it doesn't even want us to connect them. Fascinating. Okay, so we need a livestock unit. Okay, let's get in here and take a look. That's going to be, where is the livestock unit? Over here? Oh no, don't tell me. I don't think we have it. I think we're going to have to go up to the anomaly to get them, but let's find out. No, 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 no. They're right here. So we need four more metal plates and 50 fecium, and this one requires... What was the other one? It did say automated feeder. Right. Okay. Another four metal plates. So we need eight metal plates all to total with an amino chamber. So let's get that one, at least. We'll get the metal plates created real quick. I'm almost out of... of uh... Ferrite. Look at that. And do I have anything on me that I can make into ferrite? No, of course not. Fascinating. It's amazing when you have these saves that you don't have any of this stuff. But uh, amino chamber, I've got the amino chamber, of course. Should be able to make it, I think. Nope, I don't have the recipe. Wow. So this is what you run into when you use these saves, folks. So we're going to jump back in our ship. We've got to actually go to the anomaly. We could go to the space station and hope for the best and see if they maybe have some. But, yeah. There's that. I had a funny feeling what I should have done is probably stopped at the space station after we exited in the system. That way we could go back and forth to the space station. Yeah, that would have been a smart idea. But, as you know, you rush these things, you don't always do the smart thing. Okay, so we need to... Hopefully I have the very tech to buy this stuff. I guess we're going to find out in a moment. Hi, guys. Just passing through. Alright, amino chamber will be over here. Alright, that's down here. We got plenty of nanites to get it, so that'll do... Hope we don't need anything else. And what was the other thing we needed to create? Let me think here. 
We need Fecium, which I don't have. There are no animals on that planet, so I can't get Fecium that way. And I know there's probably a recipe for Fecium somewhere. Okay. Let's head over to the space station first. So this gives you a rough idea of what you're going to need to. So don't forget to grab some things before you go. You know what? I just thought of something. Hold on. Because my ship doesn't have that in there, right? It doesn't have much of anything. But did my other ship have it? Let me see. Try the Squiddy real quick. Let me check. Nope. And let's check my other ship real fast. Uh, that's going to be you. Nope, we don't have anything in there either. Okay, let's go back to the original ship. And we'll head to the space station. Let's see, there it is. Space station, here we come. That's our next stop. So we need Fecium, and while we're... Cruising along, let's go into our exosuit and create our amino chamber, which requires 20 chlorine. So that's another thing that we're going to end up needing. Wow. So this becomes better and better. Hmm. I wonder. While we're here, we may just be cleaning out our inventory, too. And wham. Okay. Okay. Plus, we got to check out a new space station. Hmm, pretty cool. like these new space stations. They're really, really neat. Definitely a good idea. All right. So let's head to the trade terminal and see what we can, well, sell. I need to make some room in my inventory anyway, so we'll sell a bunch of stuff real quick here. All right, so, uh, bone, bone. I'm going to sell, I'm going to hang on to the meat for now because I got an idea on that for later. Okay, not a guy, I've got some more of that stuff. We'll hang on to the quad servos for now. Arco bulkhead, very good. Bone, bone. Uh, more bones. Ah, Bizarre Skeleton. Very, very nice. Okay, we'll get, the, uh, get rid of that and that. Definitely hanging on to those. Okay, good. Looks like we got the useless stuff out of our inventory. Alright, let's take a peek. We need ferrite, so I'm going to grab that. Since we're running low anyway. Uh, we could grab some metal plates. They really don't have anything else for us here. So that's not good. Alright, any pilots? Plenty of pilots floating around here, so let's check them out. We can get them to stop talking anyway. And I'll keep grabbing some ferrite because we do need it. Chromatic metal, good. Rusted metal. And we don't really need it. Chlorine, hey! You know how much, you know what? I'm not going to mess around. Let's grab it all. We got the money. Okay, now we just need Fecium. Oh, he's leaving. And he's leaving. They all left me. They've left me alone. Darn it. Okay. So maybe we should just have to wait for another ship to pop in here. And we'll check for PCM next. Otherwise, we're going to have to land on a planet. I think we can turn some of the meat into something, but maybe it just turns into Mordite. Uh, I don't quite remember. But we'll find out. What do they have here, by the way? I'm not interested in the multi-tool. Let's go ahead and upgrade our exosuit real quick. Always want to make more room when you can. I'm going to put it up here. And what kind of uh, upgrades you got for me, buddy? While we wait for more ships. Thermal protection on the cold. Uh, let's see what we've got right now, because that's kind of important. Looks like we've got hot protection, cold protection, radiation, and toxic. All right, so we really do have everything we need. We don't need anything from that. Uh, we got some nice upgrades for this. 
219. It's always good to get a nice upgrade once in a while. So we do have a movement module A. We've got underwater protection, life support, and hot protection. And cold protection. Okay, so not going to get anything from this guy. All right, what kind of ships landed? Okay, we got another guy right here, another guy there. Let's look for Fecium. I'm going to check the hauler because the haulers tend to have different inventory than the other ships that we've had land. Grab more ferrite because I didn't realize I was so low. You have nothing. You worthless little Corvax. That's okay. We're good. Let's check him out. The analyst. What do you got, Analyst? Do you have anything for me? Uh, again, I'll grab that. We should be getting to a good amount of that now. Residual goop, and that's all we've got. All right, well... All right, we're going to have to call it here, and we're going to head back. we got two other ships that did land. I will check them out real quick because they are here. And if they don't have what we need, we're out of here. Hmm, nice, though. Tempted on grabbing that. Let me grab that. It's always good to have some phosphorus for upgrades. Not upgrades, for recharges, I should say. And other things you got to build on occasion. So we're grabbing unusual items now. Uh, let's see. Nothing there I need. Uranium, that's always good, but no, I don't need it. And finally, you, sir, since you're brand new. Got another new one that just landed. We'll check. Because you can. Yep, nothing here. Last guy. Last guy. Promise. I promise. Yeah. Same stuff. Okay, we're done. Let's head down to the planet and do the best we can. Now, what I'm probably going to do is I'm going to hit the planet in front of us. I know that we have... Let's see, that is aggressive sentinel, so it is going to be kind of hard to do what we need to do. Okay. Where's the planet we were heading towards? That is... My base should be showing somewhere around here. There it is. Okay. So we're going to head straight for the base. I was going to land on the other planet, but I think we're going to hold off on that. And I think we can turn the food into Fecium at some point. I don't know if it's possible, but we'll give it a shot. We definitely need it. If not, we can hit that planet over there on the right. Maybe it's not so bad after all. Okay, Rosell's much colony. We may end up setting up a uh, portal here so we can get back and forth to the space station if we ever do need to. There we go. Now, hopefully my... Uh... Yep, it's still here. Is there anything in it? There is. Okay, good. So we're going to pull this out. I'm going to try something with... Always looks at your ship first. I don't know why. Uh, let's do this. No, it's not going to work. Well, it's worth a shot. Let me just see if there's anything else. Nope, not going to do it. Okay, so we are out of Fecium, so we are going to have to go to another planet to get that. Since we have the one item, we can at least build one thing. Let me go ahead and get this built real quick. Uh, we need the amino chamber, which needed chlorine, I thought. Yes. There we go. And now we can build it. So we'll put that over here. It says unable to build... Huh. Well, that's weird. Very interesting. I can't seem to build it. Missing components, and there are no missing components. Let me try something real quick here with the power. Maybe that's what the problem is. There we go. Okay, so that's hooked up. And let's get these things powered up real quick. 
Just take a moment. Yeah, I'm just going to charge them up. I don't care at this point what we put in them. Let's put some oxygen on this one. Wasn't trying to scan. Thank you. And last one. Okay. Now, can I build it? Will not let me build it. I wonder if the problem is, is that we don't have any animals here. Because if you look at the planet, left-hand side, fauna, from elsewhere. Um, we can scan around, and I think we're not going to find any fauna up here. Uh, there might be that one anomalous animal. Yeah, there is one anomalous animal here. So, very, very strange. We need... Bcm, and we're not going to get it from the animal that's on this planet. So I am going to head upwards, and we're going to go to a different planet real quick. This is a very odd situation. I'm sure you're all starting to realize it as well. Uh, there's a planet way over there. There should be one nearby. Where's the planet? Let's look. It should be right here. There you are. How bad are you? Okay, you're good. It's a hot planet. There'll be plenty of animals there. interesting return to the habitable planet and yet there's one anomalous creature there that isn't going to be fed with creature pellets i'll tell you that maybe they are maybe they changed it somehow we're going to check that out too but i need the fecium so we have fecium on us i think we do not fecium pardon me creature pellets yeah we got some that's fine There we go. Alright, let's take a look around. So, first things first, we need to see if there's any animals here. It may take a couple moments for them to show up. we got one already. Let's go check it out and see what it is. Interesting. Okay. So we need to feed them. I need to set that to a hot key. There we go. And let's see what we get. We're going to get three of them over here. That's fine. Four of them? Oh, okay. That's cool. Five of them. Nice. And we'll just give it a couple moments. We could shoot them, but I'm not going to do that. We'll get Mordite out of it, but... I don't think it's the Mordite I'm really worried about here. There's another one. Okay. Let's see if these guys actually do their business anytime soon. Now, I've run into some missions where they don't. They won't do any business at all, and you're stuck with whatever you got. There we go. Okay, good. All right. Okay, they did their business. We end up with about 46 feces, it says. That's pretty good. Uh, let's see. So when we want to build this, it's not going to tell us how much it's going to take to make it. But we should have everything we need, I think. Now, we can duplicate that, but we'll need a bigger scanner. A bigger scanner. Bigger refiner. You know, you know what I meant. I'm going to scan these animals while I'm here. That's always going to be helpful to me. It looks like we got four of the five. 
Okay. That's interesting. I don't know what the fifth one is. Let's find out. Ground. So, just looking for one more animal. Did you just attack him? Well, that was like rude. Okay. Wow. Go figure, huh? Okay, I was hoping to get the big guy over here because it looked like he might uh, have some more for me. And ship is right there. So we're going to wait for that for just a second. We're going to wait for this guy to do his business. I would like to have at least 50 on me. We got 66. Okay, so that'll be just one more then. Because, you know... He should in just a moment, any time now. Well, maybe not. Ooh, it's getting a little toasty, isn't it? Alright. Maybe he's not. Let's go ahead and head back. And we'll come back here if we need to. How's that sound? I like that idea better. Let's go to our... Base? Wonder if we can squeeze past the anomaly. That would be interesting. Are we even lined up with our base? I think we are. Yeah. All right. So here I thought this could be like a 10, maybe 15 minute episode, but these episodes for this type of action take so long sometimes. All right, there we go. And park it. Okay, so we need to make this. So we have everything we need now. We even have the polyfiber, which thank God we got on our last one and I kept on me. So let me put this in here. And then we make that, which it still will not let me build. Now it says I'm short one metal plate. But still won't let me build it. Well... I'm going to try one last trick here, folks. I have an idea. I know, scary. But it happens. We're going to go back here. Which is our closest planet right now. Because I thought about doing this before, in order to get this unit built, but I think what it requires is a planet with actual animals on it. And if that's the case, my suggestion would be to go to a different planet, preferably something without um, aggressive sentinels. So this is going to be really weird. So now that that's here, let's see what happens now that we're here, whether we can actually put this down. Still will not let us build it. Find nearby creatures with food. So I think the anomaly mission is broken, folks. Unless I'm missing something. Let me do something here. I'm wondering if maybe it requires more than what they're saying. Let 
Creature pellets? Do I not have enough creature pellets? I don't. And it said I did. Oh. That was it. That was it. So there you are. Make sure you have enough creature pellets. It was lying to me. It was lying to me. Very interesting. So it said you needed 10. It said I had 10, but I didn't actually have 10 creature pellets. Fascinating. So you see the mistakes. That's part of the playing the game, isn't it? It's something we do to get used to all this. Let me line up a little bit better. There we go. And we're on our way. So let's actually put it down where we belong. Now that we've gone back and forth with this planet twice. And back and forth with the space station. And on to the anomaly. Trust me, the speedrun will be better. I promise. Makes me wonder whether I shouldn't use one of my other saves to actually go through the anomaly mission from now on. So I have a rough idea of what I'm going to need. So if you do this from a brand new save, if you're doing this on your own from a brand new save, please note all the items you need, like the amino chamber. And the polyfiber, which is a real pain in the neck to get if you didn't get it from a previous mission. But I'll show you a little something about that, because you probably don't want to waste it, but... Anyway. There we go. What else do we need? Oh, we got to connect them. Okay, let's do that real quick. Done. And we just have to upload the base. Okay, so this is finished. Let's upload the base next. Upload. Base is uploaded. So I'm going to pick this up. Alright, so the mission is complete. Before you leave, start unloading everything and you'll get all those items back hopefully see got everything gone so if you want to check just go into your inventory and take a look and you'll see i've got all five of my polyfibers now i had three I'm back to five and i'm going to go ahead and get rid of the base and delete it again getting some resources back and this way we don't clog up the system <laughs> if you will And there we go. Well, that was interesting, huh? So, it lies to you about your creature pellets. And our anomaly... I don't know why it says I have a base there. I thought I deleted it. Oh, nope. That's the anomaly. <laughs> it's using the icon to indicate that that's where you go to complete your mission. Alright, we're on our way. Docking with the anomaly. All right. So again, Saturday, 4.15 p.m. Eastern Time, speedruns. We should be, get, be able to get at least two speedruns done, maybe a third. Maybe a third. We'll see. And the, the great news for me is that Delta's out of town this weekend, and he won't be able to challenge me. So I'll be able to hold the record for a little longer before he destroys it. Ha <laughs> ha. All right, we got it completed. It is done. We got our 1800. We got our factory override unit. Let's check the Quicksilver vendor like we normally do and see what they've got. Number one. So our Titan fireworks are still on their way. We're at 99%. We are almost there to release the first one. So close. So close. And that's it. And if you've done the anomaly mission, pardon me, if you've done the latest expedition the adrift expedition you can do it from your regular save from this terminal here but if you've already done it from here you can go in here later and create a multi-tool based on the one you just had you can also recreate the starship multiple times but if you want to just claim the starship you can come back to the quicksilver vendor and actually just claim it just go to number three here expedition rewards and you can claim the iron vulture for your own so there you go folks I hope you enjoyed this episode. Please hit the like and subscribe. Really enjoy doing this for you folks. And I enjoy um, all that we can do in order to make things easier. Again, if you have any questions, leave them in the comments section. If you have any ideas of things you'd like to see in No Man's Sky, like some explanation 
or something that you said, hey, I found this and it doesn't work or does work, can you try it? Let me know. That's what I do. And we'll put it in the 101 videos for training for the rest of us. And if you go back out of the anomaly like I just did, it will bring you back to the original system you were at. And I'm doing that myself because I'm still running through some of the missions, the main missions, for this particular playthrough. So I want to get back to where I started. And there we go. So I'm going to go ahead and land this at the space station, and we're going to call this mission done. And again, thank you all for watching. So we are... It is Friday, Friday the 28th of June. That is great. And I hope you all have had a great Friday. I hope you had a great week. There we go. We're coming in on the uh, landing at this point. Excellent. And there we go. Okay. And that's all the news from me. So uh, appreciate Delta. Thank you very much for your kind comments as well, Delta, lately. Uh, we, we will be... Uh, challenging you on the weekend and of course we got a few more weeks of this uh, expedition to go so i expect that you're going to kind of blow me out of the water at some point and we'll have to reanalyze the whole thing again but that's all good it's all an excellent competition having a great time pretty sure jason didn't come close to anything but i haven't watched his stream to see how he ended up but we'll see how and how it works out all right guys take care again hit that like please subscribe if you like what you've been seeing we'll see you in the next video take care everybody